Welcome back to my channel. So today we are unboxing Ipsy the August, no, the July Ipsy glam bag. And when mine came, it was so sad because it had a rip and one of the products was already falling out. I'm so glad I didn't lose anything because I did have an add-on. So stay tuned to see what I got at the end of this video. guys have to see this ipsy bag it is gorgeous i am keeping this bag it's zipper i love the blue and kind of this gold brown design and the theme says stay golden so it has it on the bag and i love that the inside is all blue as well it definitely feels like a beach theme here the first one is the one i'm most excited about the pure elise watermelon charcoal cleanser i have never tried pure elise before a lot of people love their mask but i've never tried their cleanser and i'm more excited about cleansers than mask really i'm not a clay mask type of person i'm more of a sheet mask type of person it's nice and sealed here's what it looks like right there the next item that I got is a hand lotion, Glow on Fifth Beauty, Keep It Handy, Chamomile Hand Cream. So it looks like that. Nice and blue. Me too. Me too. Okay, you want to try it? Yeah. It has no fragrance at all. Mmm. I don't know for some reason for hand creams i kind of want it slightly fragrance but it's not bad it's not bad it's not oily it actually feels very clean and it just sinks into the skin nicely did i show you guys this nice detail right here so pretty next item is cute a real her dream so big eyeshadow duo cute and I think this is the full size that you get from Ipsy. I wish they'd send me a brush. I love this mauve color. Ooh, I've heard of Real Her before. Glitter Look at pink. that. It's pretty shimmery. Glitter pink. And ooh, I love this mauve color. Ooh, look at that. It's super pigmented. Didn't have a lot of high hopes for this, but it looks gorgeous. And another one is a blush by hip dot and it looks like this there's no mirror or anything let's see let's see Ooh, Ooh. super pink Pretty. and pigmented you might think this isn't gonna work for my skin for my skin tone but it can it actually is very flattering these these ones I have no makeup on today. Absolutely no makeup. Just sunscreen, guys. <gasps> love that little flush that it gave my skin. Pretty and, and I love the packaging. This is super cute packaging. Super cute. Okay. And then the last one in here is the one that I'm most excited about. This is the Tarte Quench Hydrating Primer. <laughs> what? Oh, no. Can you get it? <gasps> <laughs> thanks trini she has small hands it, it fell in between the the chair and the middle console in my car so i use my scissor finger oh you use your scissor finger <laughs> thank you baby um this is the tart quench hydrating primer this is super cute packaging guys i wish you could see it i wish it would focus i cannot wait to try this one guys you know me, I love trying primers. Have you guys seen my video on um, my primer collection? Definitely check that out. Um, and I have some great info about each and every one of the primers, what they're good for, are they good for oily, acne prone skin, some of my favorite primers that I've tried. So check that video out. I'll put it up here or in the link up there. And yeah that is it guys what do you think about my ipsy i think it's just a so so bag 
not the best that I've had. I would say I'm excited about the blushes and the eyeshadow the most, which I thought was going to be my least favorite. But actually, no. Now that I look at it, I really love everything that I got. Love the eyeshadow. I wasn't expecting much from this, but I love how the eyeshadow turned out. And then the blush is just as good. I love that color brush. I love Tarte Pure Release Cleanser and the hand cream, which you can never get enough of. So, you know what? It's a good bag. It's a good bag. Now, let's get into my add-ons. It's only one thing. So, if you spent $25, you would get a free tweezer. This tweezer is so fancy looking. I don't even know how to open it. <laughs> it's by Farah. Farah brushes. I've never heard of this brand before, but uh, there's just no way of opening this. Oh, you know what? I'm ripping through the bag. It looks so fancy to be ripped open like that or even cut with scissors. Like, where's the opening? I love this plum purple color. Look at that. Wow. It looks like super high quality. So I'm excited about that. And then what wow. cost me $25 it's a $40 value, full-size Anastasia Beverly Hills uh, liquid lipsticks. And it has the shimmer, and they're all nudie, pinky nudie lipsticks, which I gravitate towards. And I think there's two shimmery ones. Now, I'm curious about this one because why does this look like used? It's not all the way full like all the other ones. Mm -hmm. Which one should we try? I think because of my skin tone, the darkest one would be the best for me. So this color is beaming. Oh dear, it's going to be beaming. And this color right here is going to be on mute. On mute. mute. I got to use my other hand. Okay. It looks like it's going to work. I'm so glad. Let's see. It's a little cool tone on me. Let's try the shimmery gloss. Shimmery gloss. Shimmery gloss. <gasps> oh my gosh. <laughs> Did you guys see that? Pretty light. It kind of washed me out a bit. The tube is very mm. deceiving. It's very cool tone pink. I thought they were warmer, but it's not. I feel like they are a little drying on the lips, but... You can't beat $25 for five full-size Anastasia liquid lipsticks. I mean, one of these is like $18. But that is it, guys. That is my one and only add-on. And I don't know. It's, it's not my favorite. <laughs> but that's okay. I love the deal. And these are so pretty. I mean, really. Someone with the right skin tone will enjoy and love these lipsticks. So these liquid lipsticks. So that is it guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, like, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I post videos once a week on skincare and beauty reviews as well as some unboxings here and there. Definitely stick around, subscribe, join the family. And with that said, I hope you guys have a great rest of your day and I'll definitely see you back in my corner soon. Bye!